So I got a video on how to remove the smart track rudder and or reinstall it. First thing I do is to lower the rudder all the way down, release it. So you have slack in the, in the string. Come back here and then when you turn the rudder, you'll find a notch that lifts it out, out like so. And you can see the notch there. So to reinstall it, you need to, when you stick it back in, it won't go all the way down. So you have to turn it to find where that notch is at. And then it pops down in. And then when you turn it back out, now it won't come out. That is how you do it. And when you're transporting it, a tip is to lock it in the upright position. Locking it in the upright position won't allow it, it won't allow it to move to where the notch is at to where it'll fall out. That is it.